Well, Thanksgiving is next week, and if you are still in the planning process, you want to keep it local, then we got you covered. From, from places to buy local produce to protein to where you can make reservations if you're dining out, the Duke City is the perfect place to celebrate Thanksgiving. And joining us now to tell us about Thanksgiving in Albuquerque is our around town expert and Yelp rep, Howie Kaibel. Hey, Howie. Howie Yo. Good to see you, buddy. Hi. All right. So we're talking locally sourced turkeys, produce. We want to keep it local. Where do we go? All right, let's start with uh, the side items, and then we'll talk about the birds. Okay. So, uh, Skarsgård Farms. Do uh -huh. you know about Skarsgård Farms? Absolutely, yeah. We have a little testimonial review here on uh, on the screen mm -hmm. from someone who has uh, started using Skarsgård Farms for virtually everything that they have in their kitchen. Really? Um, wow. And it's a great it's a great review. She really talks about how um, so Skarsgård basically sources completely local. Mm -hmm. Everything that you're getting is seasonal mm -hmm. and you get these boxes of produce and then you can also choose to also order some proteins and some other you know milk and some other things alongside oh. it. But the produce is the important part. You're right. going to get a box delivered to your house and you do just order online. Mm -hmm. So if you were ordering online this week, um, a large box is going to contain uh, cranberries, butternut squash, young coconut, pecans, fingerling potatoes, celery, turnips, pears, avocados, radishes. Wow. Does that Lovely. not sound like Is it frozen? Thanksgiving? Wow. Uh, no, it's all fresh produce. Okay, fresh. but you can freeze it. Oh, sure. Right? Absolutely. Good stuff. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. yeah. That's it's great. A, and, okay. It's really reasonably priced, okay, too. Okay, so for the best organic. way to do it, go onto their website, mm -hmm. order it, and they deliver it. Sign up for it. Yeah. That's really great. simple. Very cool. And then uh, local birds, uh, mm -hmm. definitely La, La Montanita Co op. Uh huh. Uh, they, have, they order birds from Embudo Valley, mm -hmm. which is north of Espanola. They're organic turkeys. Um, they eat certified organic grains and seeds. Mm -hmm. And then they also have a, a less expensive option, less pricey option, uh, Mary's Free Range Chickens out of California. Okay. And they just, uh, they're from a real, a big free range uh, farm. Uh, and also Keller's Farm Stores. Uh -huh. I actually just ordered from them yesterday. Okay. Um, they source pretty locally. And um, uh, again, they're going to, they, a lot of people just talk about how high quality their meats are. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Okay, so what if you're kind of lazy and want to eat out for Thanksgiving? Where can we go in Albuquerque to hint, serve hint. up a Are you? <laughs> are you? Um, well, there are a lot of great places. Let's start with Man's Giving. Do you know about Man's no, Giving? No. Tell us about this. This is at Altitude Sports Bar at Hotel oh, Cascada. Great place. So all day long, 10 o'clock in the morning until 11 o'clock at night, they're just going to they're, they're not really messing around here. They, they recognize that there are some guys who are really in Thanksgiving for the football. So right. they offer barbecue ribs, char-grilled turkey legs, slabs of ham, and all the other fixings. There's no cover. You just hang out, watch the, watch the games. You just have to cool. grunt. You just have to be <laughs> like Neanderthal. Exactly. Neanderthal thing. That's great. Well, our, our producer's telling us they're actually going to be on tomorrow. So we'll, oh, cool. Uh, we'll, cool. We'll have to grunt, Rachel. Get your, get your grunt ready. Awesome. Right. There you go. So uh, <laughs> up for us. A, a family option would be at Moss. Uh -huh. um, they're going to, they, they do something 11 to 3 um, with just live music. And, you know, Moss it serves up some fantastic food. The other one I'm going to point out is the Puebla Harvest Cafe. We talk about great. this cool. place a lot. What's wonderful about it, and I think what's wonderful about New Mexico Thanksgiving celebrations is we have this cultural, uh, you know, addition to the food, which is just special for this state. So the Pueblo Harvest Cafe has Native American inspired dishes. So you're going to get um, a venison asobuco, um, bison meatloaf, mm -hmm. seared duck breast, oven bread, uh, uh, oven bread stuffing, roasted butternut squash. And, and then they have an Eggs Benedict station. All that sounds An like Eggs Benedict station. Awesome. That sounds wow. awesome. Wow. Okay. Yeah, right. All right, yeah. so if we want to look this stuff up on Yelp, Howie, what's the best way to use the app or to use the website to do so? Good question. We've got two really good options here. First, first of all, if you haven't signed up for the weekly Yelp, go to yelp.com slash weekly. Mm -hmm. Sign up for Albuquerque's edition. This week I have a, a weekly newsletter that's specifically devoted to local restaurants that are doing uh, Thanksgiving celebrations. So just sign up for that. It'll come out coming to your inbox every Wednesday. Mm -hmm. And then also just go to our events page. We have all kinds of posts uh, uh, for local uh, Thanksgiving celebrations around the city. Fantastic. So lots of options available yeah. for you, whether or not you're doing it at home or, you, you know, like Rachel and me, like, I don't want to mess this we're up. We're making we'll it, it easy for us, exactly. Howie. <laughs> Yelp's got you covered. Head over to Casa.com for all the information. We'll have the links there.